Hello everyone and welcome back. This is Danny Code and this is episode number eight of the Machinkies One Way Stations playthrough. We have traffic issues. Um, so we're gonna need to take care of those before we do anything else, I think. The foundry um, in this section here, this corridor, track corridor, is very, very busy. Um, so we're going to need to do something with that. I'm going to put in an express rail. I already put an express rail going from our main track to here. Um, but I also want to put in an express rail going the other direction. So that should help, you know, at least uh, from the foundry here going up this way. So that should at least help that. So let's do that real quick. And I also want to, before I do anything, uh, put on some more platforms here because it seems like there's too many things parked here. And if there's too many things parked here, the domino effect happens with the traffic and then there's too many things waiting and parked over here. And then this um, T-junction here seems to really get bogged down. Okay, so let's do that. So let's go ahead and put in a express rail or side rail, I should say. Um, going in this direction, and we'll tee it off just from here. Oops, tee it off just from here. There we go. And again, I'm using the um, fast tracks instead of the slow tracks. So if you see like this discoloration between tracks, that means this this lighter color track is the slower track, and this is the um, fast track. What we can do, um, what I've been doing also, is we can just upgrade. So, so if you have, if you're in your fast track or high speed track, I should say, um, you have this upgrade button, and that makes it really simple to upgrade your old track because that actually upgrades not only the track but the signal. So you see, let's see here, you see these old signals, right? So they, we have the old whatever signals, the manual signals, and then that puts it over into the lights. So now we have lights going on there. And you can see it here, like watch the signal here. We got the old manual signal, and then that goes over into the light. So it does everything. It not only does the track, it does the signals as well. Okay, so let's continue on making our side rail here. Just make everything much better. And what I'm gonna do too, I'm not only gonna make the side rail, but I'm gonna make trains that use this corridor use that side rail because sometimes they won't do that. So I'm going to put like waypoints on some of these some of these trains as well. Um, so let's go ahead and we'll bridge over this. And to do that, we put in our two things like that. And then we'll create our bridge coming from here to here. And let's go ahead and start doing the iron suspension. I think those are pretty cool, right? Yeah, that looks great. And then hook that right up to side rail here like so. Let's go ahead and delete this because that looks ugly. We don't need it. Good. And then hook this into, we'll just hook it into it like, mm, we'll do this, go like that. There we go. Um, before we do anything, let's go ahead and put signals here and here, good. And then, so when, when trains are using the side rail, let's go ahead and, I hope, I don't know, it's gonna be a little tricky. Let's go ahead and put in that is going to be, well, maybe I can just do it. Yeah, so hold on, let me pause. Let me grab some of these signals and get rid of them. And then we should be able to hook up just like that. Yeah, there we go, perfect, nice, I love it. Cool, and we'll put a signal here, 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 and there. Nice, I love it, great. Works cool. Nice. I like it. I don't think we need it. Well, maybe one one on the bridge. No, we should be fine there. All right, and all we need to do here is go ahead and do the auto signal placement for this side of the track, and then go ahead and signal this up. 
signal that up, and then we got we got it going. I this looks ugly. I want I want to upgrade these. <laughs> Just every time I see them. There we go. It's good enough, All right? We'll do this whole section. Okay. And do we have anything else over here that needed that? No. Okay. And also, I almost forgot. Let's go ahead and do this as well. You know, and I want to put it on here, but it's too close. And I think we can get away with putting it here. I think. I think maybe. Yeah, I think that'll be fine. And why I'm I'm saying that is because a lot of times I like to only have one way in and out of the circle. Um, but I have something over here and something over here. I'd like to hook these up to the actual um, actual one way in and out here. But I'm hooking it up to the circle, so that may that may also cause issues. But um, we'll see. We'll figure it out, and that should be fine. Just like that. There we go. Okay, now I think we're all set. So what I want to do is I want to make sure, like I said, I want to make sure that these have waypoints. So where is this going? This is going from the foundry to um, the tool works. So this is a perfect one to go ahead and Actually, this is a perfect one to go ahead and go ahead and uh, use our new route. So instead of station six, what we're going to do is we're going to go over to station whatever this is, station 20, instead of station six. Just like that. Yeah, and that'll use the new route. Um, so there's one down. All right, so what else is using this route here? Um, so this guy has to because he has to go over into the this section here. And I don't see anything else quite yet. So let's unpause and see what we got. Oh, so this guy here, right? So he's going from, let's pause again. He's going from... Station 13, which is all the way up here in the north. I'm, I'm going to call that north to station here. So that, this guy, we want to make sure he not only uses the outside rail here. Well, no, so he can't use that. So he, but we want to make sure that he uses this express lane, right? And we'll stick that there. So he's going to come from here. He's going to travel down. And he's going to use this express lane. So he will use that, go through the tunnel, and go over into um, the foundry. So that works as well. Okay, so we'll just we'll just leave it alone for now, and hopefully trains will find their own way. Um, but I also want to, before I do anything else, I want to upgrade this station platform here and just stick on a few more just so we don't have any lot of traffic waiting and parked, waiting to unload and load. And this should happen, this should this should take care of the traffic, I hope, because it is it does become an issue here. Okay, and we'll signal it up, there and there. And then two more signals here on the outbound rail. Oops, and one more signal that we deleted here. Cool. Then on these, we need to put chain signals. And there we go. So that should take care of, hopefully, a lot of the traffic going there. So let's let's hope let's hope that does. We already have, you know, some trains here using the uh, using the rail. Nice, and that works very well. Cool. Okay. So, with that said, let's go ahead and we need to do deliver more coal 
to our to our tool works here because you can see the tool works here we don't have I mean it's making it as soon as it comes in it's making it right so this is what's going to get most of our uh, or a lot of our resource tokens going okay so let's look at planks first so this station here this station at the um, at the sawmill here has a abundance of timber let's go ahead real quick as we do go ahead and expand uh, at least one here I think because it looks like we're getting a little traffic here as well like that and then just signal it up here. Cool. And do we have a signal here? No, we do need a signal there as well. Okay. And a signal there. Cool. Okay. And while we're here, let's go ahead and upgrade. Okay. So let's go ahead and put on the plank train. And we'll use our old standby, the 284 class 65. And go ahead and put on a timber, timber, timber planks, whatever. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven, isn't it? Yes, seven, eight, eight. Good. So we'll go ahead and give him orders to go from the sawmill here to our new station that is hardly being used. But as you can see, we're accepting planks and coal and iron. And there we go. Start him on his way. So that should help with that. Um, now let's go ahead and put on another coal train as well. We don't have too much traffic here, so let's go ahead and just add a traffic or add a train. And I'm doing this because we're running low on. Um, we're running pretty low on, on resource tokens here, so I want to make sure before I move on to do new things, I want to make sure that I have enough of those being produced, right? So, cool. And then go ahead, and now that we have all the traffic, or we should have all the traffic um, situated, so I'm going to put him, he's going to be on a little longer, and I know it's going to be shorter to go on the main route here and then come in to the foundry, but I'm going to make him, actually no, I, I, I'm taking that back. I'm going to actually make him go on to the main rail here. Um, for the simple fact that we should be okay for traffic here, but I don't want to overburden this corridor, this rail corridor here. So we'll start him on his way as well. And we also need, um, how, many, how are we doing on iron ingot here? So we have, we have quite a bit. We have 693. So let's go ahead and put on a station that is delivering iron ingot. Or I mean a train that is delivering iron ingot from this station to our tool works. Um, let me see here. So we got one, two, three, four, four it is. And we'll give him orders to go from our foundry and I want to make sure that he uses well he, he will use it because he's going to the new station um, but just to make sure let's just to make sure we're gonna put on a waypoint here there we go and then go to our tool works okay so that should help an awful lot in our resource tokens and our traffic okay so I don't want to make this video too long um, the next thing we're gonna do though our one more goal we're gonna do something uh, we're gonna progress on and make sure that we have our oil production um, going on and producing enough oil and we're gonna start using new trains to do that because one while we were um, upgrading all our other stuff we have we have a good amount of oil tokens going on and since we're going to upgrade our 
our oil production from our oil well to our refinery to our um, factory. Since we're going to upgrade that, we're going to actually be making a lot more. Let's look at these real quick. Testing. Use a modified 52 plus to transfer passengers to 60. Uh, let's postpone that. The Ewing oil, we did. And take a break. That's just riding on your train. We'll do that in a little while. And the commodity one is just transport goods to three different um, three different uh, towns, cities. What that means is that it's just going from, um, because the factory is now producing, and we have, we probably have a good amount, yeah, we have like 160 of them. So the factory now is, is getting oil and then producing goods. Those goods can be delivered to cities that have these shops in them, these new shops. So, um, so we'll do that in our next video. But for this video, the next thing we want to do is just, the last thing we want to do is just upgrade our uh, oil production. So the first thing I'm going to do, as we do, we're going to put on secondary station at our oil well here, our secondary platform, real quick. And as I'm clicking on all the wrong buttons, <laughs> I can't talk and play at the same time. I cannot walk and chew gum at the same time uh, Some sometimes. Um, let's go ahead and signal it up as we do and put a chain signal here and then put our block signals in at the beginning of the station or the entrance and then the exit here and here and that's good cool so now we have two platforms there let's go ahead and and as you can see we have tons of oil here so let's let's try to do two i think two more going from the oil well to the um, refinery we're going to use the bdz 52s um, they use uh, one oil for the operating cost. I'd like to use the EMD F3, but they use two. However, well, you know what? I'm going to use one of these. I'm going to use just at least one. Let's just use one because I, I really like these. You can see the top speed is 81 miles per hour, and they can carry tons because their power is 1,400 horsepower. And compared to the BDZ, we have only 40 miles per hour, which is super slow, which is less than half. And the power is also less than half as well, 600, compared to 1,400 hours power. So even though it uses two, maybe it's more efficient. I'm going to go with that. <laughs> let's see if that works for us. Um, so let's just do oil. And we can only do, uh, since I was going to use two of the BDZ, right, since I was going to use two of these, maybe we can just use one of these and get uh, just as much, right? Who knows? Let's see. Let's see what we get. So we have 453 tons to play with, and um, we're only up to 283. Um, but we don't want to go over the length because I think that'll be an issue. Okay, so that's perfect. How many how many cars do we have? I don't. I've lost count. I didn't. I wasn't counting. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Perfect. And I think if we use the other train or engine, uh, we probably wouldn't even have half of that. So. Go ahead and give him orders. Coming from the oil well to the refinery. And before we start him on his way, what we're gonna do is I wanna see him come out of the station and we're gonna travel with him. And we're gonna do that because we have this take a break thing. So I wanna, I wanna do some, uh, I wanna ride some trains to do that. All right, so let's go ahead and ride him. Coming out the station. There we go. Here we going? Here we go. Coming out the station. <laughs> Neat. All right, get a look around. There's our oil tankers. Nice. There's a cab. We got a little chair for me. Or whoever is driving. Got another chair over there. Let's see, we got we got uh Oh yeah. There we go. I'm liking it. Let's speed it up a little bit here. So cool. So we're coming. 
went up the station going through the bridge and then we're going to go to our main rail or going under the bridge very cool we're going to go to the right here or to the, to the left and then go towards nice like it Nothing following us. Nope. There goes the sister train. Nice. And we should be coming up to the oil mine. Or oil mine. Oil well. I think that's it there. So we should be going over to the left here. There it is. Rolling around to our oil well. And there it is, our oil well. Neat. Haha, <laughs> that's so cool. Speed it up a little bit. There we go. I'm liking these signals as well. They change and they get the green, yellow, and reds. Nice. Very cool. Okay, so let's go ahead and just follow this guy. So then these guys are really super fast. As long as we have the, the high speed rails, these ones here, um, they can go over 50. So we're, we're clocking 40. Yeah, so we're, we're already over. Yeah, we're cooking. Look at them go. That's nice. I think we made the right decision there. So we have one of those going from our oil well to our refinery. So let's do another one going from a refinery to our uh, factory. But before we do that, let's make sure that we're we're fully uh, upgraded here, and we are not. Let's go ahead and do that real quick. And our research lab research laboratory as well. So that should because we have now we have a good amount of oil. We need to be producing uh, much more um, uh, refined oil and then delivering that. So with that said, we should have, oh, how about our station here? We have freight station and storage building to make sure, sure we have that. And we already have our signal box. Okay. So with that said, one more train for this episode. We're going to have another one of our super dupers. And then we're going to get some refined oil. One, two, three. How many? How many can we put? One, two, three, four. Uh, let's get over here. We don't. I can't see with the length. There we go. Um, so how many more? Oops, too many. <laughs> too many. So let's go ahead and just take one of them off. And how many do we have? We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that's a good amount. Cool. And give him orders to go from. And we're gonna do. I want to make sure that we have four. We have four platforms here. So I want to make sure that um, he's full when he leaves, right? Because he's pretty expensive to to run. And I think if they if they stay if they're at, if they're parked at a platform waiting for waiting to be full or waiting to unload. Um, they're not using their fuel I'm not sure I'd, I'd have to look that up but I'm, I'm sh pretty sure that's the case um, so let's wait till they're full and then go over to our factory and we'll start them up and there he goes speed it up a little bit as you can see, he's going over some slow rails, so he won't be able to go over 50 on some of these. But once he hits the new track, he will be able to go. And there he goes. So now he's up to 70. Eight, there he goes. 81 miles per hour on that straight track. Nice. He is cooking along. Look at him go. Oh my goodness. <laughs> nice. Wow. He's just cooking along. 
Okay, guys, I think that's where we're going to leave it for this episode. And I will be back with another episode next week. I just, I'm trying to do two things at once again. <laughs> Here we go. I just wanted to come up and do that. Um, so, yeah, so we have now our traffic situation um, better near the foundry. And also better near the tool works, so we, we did we did that, and also we made sure that we have enough resource tokens coming in, and we're going to next time we're going to expand our oil, and then save up for uh, the early diesel age, which is um, era four. So we'll go from era three to era four, and make sure we get these. Uh, these other quests out of the way. All right, that's it for now, guys. Thanks for watching. If you like this episode, go ahead and uh, smash that like button. If you want to be um, notified when new Machinki episodes come out, go ahead and uh, subscribe. And this is Danny Code. Bye for now. Mm -mm -mm.